said, if you ain't gonna lend me no cash, I ain't taking you on no date. But yo, city boys up. Out, I'll take you wherever. Like a love hotel. But you're paying for it. That is wild. Damn. This how the episode start? What? what you gonna do? Kick my ass? Man, I'm done. You're no girlfriend. You're broke. You won't put out. You're lame. Yeah. This how he talked to his You're girlfriend. Sweat, Jonah. Bro got that dope flamingo walk. Wow. Calling him seafood is pretty lame. Give me some slack. My first boyfriend just broke up with me. And who told you not to go out with him? Why'd you fall for him anyway? He looks like Ken Takakura. Again. You're such a dork. There's nothing weird about liking strong, silent types like Ken Takakura! I'm an awkward guy. There ain't no dudes, dudes alive like that anymore. Hmm. <laughs> Bro, say you don't put out. You don't do nothing. All I want is a boyfriend like Ken Takakura. Come on, universe. I'm not asking for much here. Why is life so cruel? God damn it. <laughs> what are you looking at, Jesus? <laughs> Put this magnet in it. This is gonna hurt. <laughs> so, what you reading? Anything cool? Huh? Oh. Uh... Crazy. Yeah, yeah, dopey. Look at that One Piece reference, bro. Fucking with it. I think I know what you're into. Huh? I think I know what you're into. Yeah, you said that twice now. There's only one reason someone like you would talk to me, and that's the reason you talk to me. Sorry, I think you got the wrong idea. I wasn't looking to be friends with you or anything like that. Just forget I talked to you. This is the reason. <laughs> Project Pegasus. The U.S. president went to Mars and met with aliens. <laughs> What? You're into the occult, aren't you? No, I don't believe in UFOs and aliens and that kind of stuff. They're not UFOs, they're UAPs! Unidentified aerial phenomena! I didn't ask, don't care. The U.S. military admitted UAPs exist and reformed their space force. They did. Now Japan has an aerospace defense force. Don't you see everyone scaring up their war in space? Okay, bye-bye. But, <laughs> hang on a sec. There's this new picture of Nessie. Look! There's also stuff about Lieutenant Colonel Jim Cannon at Skinwalker Ranch. I don't care. I just got dumped and I'm pissed off at everything. And the last thing I need right now is some nerd pushing their nerdy crap in my face. That right there is why you got no friends. Damn. There's no chance we'll ever be. Damn. It's so cool. Here. I don't believe aliens are real, but I believe ghosts are. There's no such thing as ghosts. <laughs> <laughs> what kind of jerk goes across the ground? Wrong ass. You shouldn't have mocked the occult. <laughs> For your information, my grandma's a real life medium. What? You ever see an exorcism? It's totally insane. The possessed person goes into full on convulsions. Illnesses cause convulsions too, you know. You need evidence like this to prove something? You ever go for a ride in a UFO with an alien before? Only an idiot would jump to conclusions like that. <laughs> she gave up Ken Takakura for some kooky otaku. Yeah, right? She ain't even trying to hide it. Get it, girl. I 
dare you to go to someplace haunted. And the deal is, if you end up seeing a ghost, you have to be my gopher. Only if you go with his UFOs, I mean UAPs, and if you see an alien, then you have to admit they're real and be my gopher. What is a gopher? What are we doing? What are we talking about? Where did you send me? That place is mega creepy. Why would aliens hang out here? Naki Hospital is widely known to be a UFO hotspot. If you go up to the roof, you're bound to get abducted by one. Wait, what do you mean abducted? That's when an alien kidnaps you and does experiments on your body. Hold on. Have they experimented on you? Of course. I think. Huh? Have you seen a UFO before or not? You know regressive hypnosis? Oh great, dodging the question. It doesn't matter if I saw one. All that matters is I have proof they exist and you don't have proof they don't. Ugh, shut up. Anyway, you find my place yet? What the fuck was that? I found it. I think you said ghosts don't exist. <laughs> it doesn't look bad. Okay, I'll start heading inside now. No proof there's no such thing as ghosts. Oh, you're so scared. FYI, that place is super haunted. That's what folks say online. I'm assuming go for me like Butler or something. Who 
Damn. Oh, she super outran her. Why are you screaming? So not good. I hope when I get to him, he's not dead. Um, the fuck? Alright. I'll go the other way. You're just tell bro not to run. Just rip this shit off. I'm going home. Our species is all male. Therefore, we must reproduce using cloning technology. You hear me? I want to leave. Since we are identical, evolution does not occur, resulting in conflict being eradicated along with emotion. For our species to regain reproductive functions, we require the use of your banana organs. What? We shall have intercourse with you. After which we will extract your uterus along with your bananas for research purposes. Bananas? Well, I might have dated a loser ass scumbag, but I never let him take my virginity! I'm saving it for a Ken Takakura I haven't even met yet! And there's no way you creepy aliens are tagging it! <laughs> what the fuck? We will now use psychokinesis to control your brainwaves and arouse you. How does it feel? Is your body getting warmer? <laughs> How does it feel? No! You are resisting our psychokinesis. You have a strong will. However, we shall begin. No! Shit. What the fuck? That's wild. <laughs> Give us your banana. You have taken his banana. You banana tree. You have taken his banana. We have a friendly relationship with humans and have never encountered such an aggressive one before. Please give us your banana. Fine, take it. Take whatever I have. All I ever wanted was to meet an alien. I never had any friends, and I thought if anyone would be friends with me, it'd be aliens. Ever since grade school, I've been staring up at the sky and calling out for you guys to show up. But you never did. No matter how many times I called out to you, you never came. There I was, bullied by kids and ignored by aliens. My life sucked. No one gave a crap if I was alive or dead. Miss ISA, she's the only one who stood up for me! So get your lousy hands off her! Yeah, I won't let anyone hurt her! That's real. Hear me? I'll do anything for her! I'll turn into a monster for her! Get him, a cocoon! Kick all their asses! Bye. Sorry, I don't think I can save you! You barely even tried to! 
crazy. <laughs> I can't save you. Sorry, 
I'm an awkward guy. Could you please put these on already? I'm worried I won't be able to think straight. Why is my heart beating so fast? No way. He just happened to see one of Ken Takakura's lines. That's all. Calm down. No biggie. Um, my memory for names is awful. So, which is the yours was again? Oh. I'm Ken. Ken Takakura. <laughs> what the fuck? Um, hey, that was dope. That was a pretty cool first episode. Definitely got my attention. I fuck with the comedy. Comedic effect is definitely there. Um, I think I see the plot or concept of the show. I feel like I see where we're going. Uh, de definitely love the Luffy voice actor appearance. Um, hey, peak is peak. Let me know what y'all think about this show off the first impression down in the comment section below. Till next time, peace. Just finished.